ports on our electric storage tank are 20 millimeters in size and located on the left hand side of the tank. Connect the cold water inlet first. Install a duo valve or non-return isolation valve, a pressure limiting valve and if required in your state an expansion control valve. Fit these valves onto the cold water inlet. When teeing off for the cold water supply to the tempering valve, ensure that the tee is installed after the pressure limiting valve. Run a 15mm pipe from the solar flow port located above or next to the cold inlet port and connect it to the bottom of the pump. Connect and run a 15mm copper pipe for the solar flow line. This should be fitted to the check valve which is attached to the flow meter at the top of the pump. Run the solar flow line through the eave and into the roof space. Connect and run a length of 15mm copper pipe from the solar return port on the tank through the eave and into the roof space. All copper piping used in the solar loop must be fitted with solar rated insulation. And in accordance with the Australian New Zealand 3500 standard, UV rated insulation must be used on any copper pipes exposed to sunlight. Insulation can shrink over time. To prevent gaps from occurring, secure all insulation joints with UV rated tape. All piping must be clipped in line with the Australian New Zealand 3500 standard.